Hey guys, this is Kirov speaking and today we are going to take a look at something rather nuanced and something which will improve your inner engine builder. Um, so, we have uh, been thinking of it, or at least uh, I have uh, been pondering some things and came to the conclusion that our engine designer scenarios are shit. Uh, yes, exactly, because they teach you wrong things, which isn't that good. From um, watching different people play, I see that many are building engines in a very weird, inefficient way. Uh, and namely that would be to cut off the engine power band at peak power with the rev limiter. Alright, as you can see, this is an engine which produces exactly 100 kilowatts of power. And it has a pretty nice curve overall. Uh, but we are now going to build a uh, somewhat more sporty version of it. Alright, so there we have it. A uh, still 100 kilowatt engine, but mm, smaller. And it's a push rod one, so that we get this very nice drop off with valve float and everything. And as you can see, it's it's pretty peaky. We have a nice uh, flat part up here in the torque curve, which definitely helps. Uh, but it's it's well, still pretty peaky up there. Anyway, so what we are going to take a look at now is something which you probably have noticed already. There's, there's a new stat here, and that is called the performance index. So let me tell you a bit about it. So basically what the performance index does is that it gives you an advantage if you do not cut it at maximum power but let it go a bit beyond. Because when you are in uh, say second gear and you shift at peak power then you will drop pretty far down in your rev range into third and there you would have less power than when you had, uh, if you had continued in the same gear beyond the peak. This you can see very well already in the um, car designer scenarios, and there you can easily gain like half a second and shave half a second of your zero to one hundred time if you are um, using your power band correctly and not cutting off up there, but like basically at the 90% fall off point. So when you have lost 10% of your power again, that's a pretty good point to cut it off. Um, of course, that has to compromise with reliability a bit, so your engine has to stand that. But if you can do that, then you, you have a massive performance increase because there's just so much more torque at the rear wheels available in a lower gear. Oh, so if you don't have massive wheel spin, that would help of course. Um, but anyway, so let's take a look at what happens if I to the performance index when I cut it off at 7,000 here, and it dropped by nah, around ish 5%, which is a, a significant decrease, I would say. So what happens? Uh, still, this old bug keeps reappearing in the weirdest situations. Anyway, so when do you know that you have the optimal? red line point. Well, the optimal point would give you the same value as the fully revving one. So we want to be at the 10% um, lost energy point, uh, lost power point down there and that would be a bit high up. So let's see. And there we are still good. Uh, we still have the full performance index. We still have the full power of course. But now um, we are making so much better use of the engine's potential than before. And we also get a higher performance in it. So what does this mean for the engine designer scenarios? Well, that means that now you have to compromise. Do you want to have a higher performance index and sacrifice reliability for that? I, you have to rev higher. Or do you want to um, cut it off at peak, have nice numbers on the, your datasheet, but not really the performance to back it up? Because the performance index is a reasonably realistic value. Okay, I hope that um, 
help clear things up. Uh, we are going to implement this in all the, or almost all the engine designer scenarios. We are currently running the first tests and they are looking pretty promising, I have to say. And yeah, um, that should definitely teach people how to build better engines. Anyway, so I hope you enjoyed and see you guys next time.